Hey everybody, um, getting ready for another trip. I love, 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 love taking trips in my RV. And of course, uh, before every trip, I'm always um, tweaking the, the things that um, were missing the mark from the previous trip. So this trip, I noticed that my AC was kicking on and staying on forever and ever and ever. It just wouldn't cycle off. It wouldn't cycle off until late at night when the sun was going down. So what did I do? I did a little bit of research and I found that a lot of YouTubers, uh, well, not a lot of YouTubers specifically, but a lot of people were putting... Um, this <laughs> in their cabinets because I don't know if any of you ever noticed but when you open up your cabinet it's hot in there it, it's just hot the the heat just stays in there and of course when you open it up the heat rushes out and I figured you know what there's got to be a way to keep this RV a little bit cooler uh, don't mind the mess because when I do a lot of work this is the way it goes. So what did I do? Well, I opened up all the cabinets. And I put this in it. Now what this is, is it's not, I don't know if it's what Home Depot sells, but I picked this up years ago when I was working in my workshop. I was insulating it. Um, because I noticed that when it gets cold, the metal, my workshop is made out of metal, it sweats because the inside was warmer than the outside. So I put this on there and there's actually like a, a thin piece of foam in the middle and it's wrapped in aluminum. And this is uh, fireproof. In other words, this will not catch fire immediately it will it will take time and then it will go off because it's it's aluminum it's not a fire um uh, it won't catch on fire anyway so it's it's fireproof that's what the company said so i bought two huge rolls and when i say rolls i mean they were about four feet tall, the rolls, and there was about 500 feet per roll. And it didn't take that much to do my workshop. I thought it was going to take more, but I went ahead and um, I saved the other roll. <laughs> so that's what I'm using. So I put this behind the TV. Voila. And of course, with those rolls, I, I got some tape, aluminum tape, and I've been taping it with that. I put it above my couch. Voila. See? All is good. And I put it, of course, in my cabinets. There you go. And my infamous, infamous cabinet <laughs> above oh, the microwave. See? It's in there too. Every place that I could get it in, I got it in. Okay, I even got it in behind the TV in the bedroom. See? The closets. Yes, sirree, Bob. And, of course, I got it in those cabinets up there. Let me tell you. Um, I'm in South Florida. Um, today is in the low 90s. Uh, the heat index, it feels hotter because of the humidity. Do you guys hear anything? I don't hear anything. Because my AC cycled off. <laughs> so, it's all good. See? 46% humidity. Of course, that doesn't have anything to do with humidity, but I'm just saying. Okay, I have my little dehumidifier on. I don't, I'm not going to make you guys dizzy. 
There's my dehumidifier. It works great. And um, temperature in here is 76, and the AC cycled off. And I can already tell that it feels a lot cooler in these cabinets. I wish I had a thermometer. I should have done it before and after. Okay, just wanted to, to show you what I've been up to. Of course, I'm always up to something. Right? <laughs> okay, everybody. Signing off. Oh, and by the way, I even put some behind the uh, fireplace. Yes, indeed. Okay, signing off, everybody. Have a good one. Bye.